this morning. Let's also bring in Nilufer Atile, um, trustee of uh, Turkey Mosaic Foundation, a charity as well, of course. Hello to you. Thank you for joining us. What are you guys doing to help? Hi, good morning. Um, we, what we're doing here to help is really to uh, gather, mobilize all our sources and contacts to be able to mo mobilize funds as much as possible and as soon as possible to um, the areas that are worst hit. We're a grant giving charity based here in the UK. Um, for five years, we've been giving support to grassroots charities in Turkey. And now with this emergency relief campaign, we are um, working very hard. All our community is engaging their workplaces, their schools, from cafeterias to corporate matching programs. We've gathered a lot of support to, uh, to our, the campaign that we've launched on just, just Giving. We're approaching almost one million. But there is still a lot of need to be able to recover from this disaster uh, in medium to long term. There will be a lot of need to recover from all, all aspects. Um, so it's a it's a long journey ahead of us, and um, the support of international community, private sector, global civil society, world, it's it's very much needed. So a call from us out to all the players uh, in the, in this field to please support um, victims of the earthquake. Um, yeah, from the images that we're looking at, you know, that heavy lifting gear would suggest that uh, there's um, little hope of finding anybody else alive under that rubble. But for those that have made it out alive and find themselves in centres like this, what sort of aid do you think they need most? Um, yes, you're right. We're on day six now. So the rescue operations is really coming to, uh, very, there's very little hope. Um, so to support the victims, there, there's, we've already provided um, clean water for drinking and also for hygiene purposes. There's a lot of need for sanitation in the area. Um, there is, um, we've provided a food supply through the local charities that we've worked with. Um, we're mobilizing all our funds for emergency needs, for the very short term needs. But we know from past emergency relief campaigns that there will be a lot of need. As you've mentioned in your program just before, there, there, there is deep trauma. There, there are thousands, tens of thousands of people who will need help. Uh, so we will be assisting with psychosocial um, support, working with our counterparts to recover both from a psych psychological point of view, um, and also to build back and uh, build back better, hopefully. Okay, thank you very much indeed. Thanks a lot. Going to have a, there's a little long.